So the next thing that sort of bowled us all over was the cosmetics case. I, I think the wow factor was the sheer size of it. It is a basically a square box with what is a facsimile of a screen and then what could have been a type of throne in front of it on which a woman would place a polished metal disc which would function as a mirror. The whole thing is made out of Huanghali wood or an exotic hardwood, sometimes referred to as rosewood or a pear wood of some sort. Cosmetics would be placed inside the drawer, so there's, uh, I remember five drawers, five drawers yeah. three on top, two on the bottom, these, these come out and again, all beautifully done in um, you know, mortise and tenon technique, which means they're not using nails, everything's uh, tongue and groove, they're, they're made to fit together and stay together. Uh, you sniffed inside of it. <laughs> <laughs> I did, I did. Um, and um, it, it, smelled, it smelled to me sort of like, like the lingering fragrance of cosmetics. Um, it was. It was. Because Huang Hua Li is not a fragrance. It's word. yeah. So was, it wasn't. You would, you would be right. It, yeah. um, so I. It's possible I was imagining things, but I don't. I don't think so. I think there was. There was a bit of. A bit of fragrance. Yeah. Yeah. This is arguably the most spectacular mirror stand cos combination mirror stand cosmetics case that I've ever seen. Mm -hmm. Not only again the wood and the scale, the size of it, but you mentioned also the carving and the, the fact that the area that represents a, a five panel folding screen mm -hmm. against which the mirror would be sort of propped up is all carved open work and it's all, in, in, this is why Anne says it's imperial, is it has dragons with a flaming pearl intertwined with sort of inter, interlaced kind of foliate patterns. Um, and then it all, in addition to that, on the front of the drawer, it also had intricate carvings of phoenixes. So the dragons, of course, symbolize the emperor, phoenix the empress, and then uh, also even some small chilin, which are another kind of magical unicorn-like uh, auspicious animal in Chinese um, culture. Lots of interesting and intricate imagery related to the imperial Just family there. So detailed, that carving and the open work of the screen, and it's just so elaborate. There were even those uh, dragon's heads mm -hmm. on the top of the, the, the five-paneled screen. And again, this kind of thing is only for the most prestigious people mm -hmm. in society, like the royal family.